Monday morning. About to, head to, <clears throat> about to head to the gym with Vin. I hit the gym. Look at the no, pump, guys. He doesn't, guys, he doesn't, hold up. He doesn't want to hit the gym I have again. The, I have the proof. He doesn't happens. want to hit the gym again. It's okay. I hit the gym at 5.30 in the morning. My brother, look at this. Come on, come on. See, you see, you see the, you see the little tiny bump. <laughs> the little tiny. In shape, family fitness. Good Vin. All right, guys, so we just got finished with a killer workout. Like, killer. But what'd you learn from it? What'd you learn? That sometimes you can't carry the world on your shoulders and you need assistance. So ask for help. Ask for help. Ask for help. Don't be afraid to ask for help. Good stuff happening. Good stuff happening. I need to charge my iPad. So we're gonna be training Javi today, doing a little bit more of that stuff. Kind of building out what our next possible creative room is gonna look like. Be a good, good full day of work. I got other projects I gotta work on as well, so I'll be going back and forth between training, editing the vlogs, and a bunch of other stuff. So stay tuned. It's gonna be a good day. Sometimes God's gonna tell you to put the camera down. Listen to him. Put the camera down. I just wanna be. I just wanna be creating in the future and not being my main source of income. Okay. And just being lazy. That's a big fear too. What is your creative mission or vision? I would say that's first off. It's a minister to people through videos and posts. Um, and to better my skills. Like I said, make this my career. Um, and to help build up a team, a team that's on the same page. And just to, to get my team where they want to be. Because obviously if you're a creative, you're not going to be on the creative team just because they put you there. Right. You're going to want to be on the creative team because you love to create. Running social media looks like being organized for one, trying new and old methods, and maybe even finding biblical methods um, or similar ways in the Bible, um, kind of to build like a, a method for running social media books. All right, so now we're gonna be going over our goals for the year using these goals workshop thing that Delilah has been able to Those are our goals? Mm -hmm. grab. Sure, it's probably some tax collector or something like that. What do you want me to say? Tax collector. Um, that I'm not available. Dominoes. <laughs> Hello? Uh, may I ask who's speaking? Um, I'm not, I'm not too sure, but um, have you ever heard of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ? Um, can you tell me a little bit about him? <laughs> because I feel like uh, Jesus is needed for salvation and I want to know if you are saved. <laughs> you think you're saved? <laughs> uh... 
Um, do you believe in Jesus? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, that's um, that's that's amazing. Um, is it is it is it okay if is it okay if I pray for you? So Javi goes to the gas station, right? He doesn't even ask if I want anything. It's all right though. It's all right. I could have given him money. Could have given him my card. You know. You want some bar blast? Yeah, yeah. I'm chilling. I don't. My voice is cracking. My voice is cracking, and I don't know why. Huh? I'm hurt. of the time definitely not all the time if it's more friends and family just go with the flow if it's you know somebody I'm interested in if it's a business call if it's something a little bit more important like the topic or context is more important then yeah I'd rehearse it but for the most part I don't really rehearse phone calls or what I'm going to say before making the call. Number four, what would you constitute a perfect day for you? Wow. Perfect day would be to sleep in, play some video games, a little bit of reading, but just relaxing. Movies, games, um, if, it, if I'm by myself, Definitely some video games and sleeping a little bit. If I'm with other people, board games, video games, uh, watching movies, just bonding and spending time together. Because one of my love languages is quality time. So definitely having some quality time would be the perfect day. Number five. When did you last sing to yourself or to someone else? Uh, last time I sang to myself was probably the last couple days. I sing all the time in my car. Just different songs, some throwbacks, some newer stuff. Last time I sang to somebody else was probably four to five weeks ago. Yeah, I sang a song from friends uh, called Mornings Here. <laughs> so you can look that up later, but I sang that to somebody about four or five weeks ago. And I think that was like a legitimate like singing to them, just like parody, having some fun. But yeah, that's, uh, that's probably it. I can't remember singing to somebody else like outside of that. So hopefully those questions worked Everyone's asleep. I gotta go. I'm gonna wrap up the vlog, so I will see you all tomorrow, hopefully answering a few more.